सेकेंड क्वेश्चन वी हैव अ फिक्स्ड पुली इज ड्रिवन बाय अ हंड्रेड के जी मास फॉलिंग एट अ रेट ऑफ एट मीटर इन फोर सेकेंड इट लिफ्ट अ लोड ऑफ सेवेंटी फाइव के जी एफ कैलकुलेट द पावर इनपुट टू द पुली टेकिंग द फोर्स ऑफ ग्रेविटी एज वन के जी एज टेन न्यूटन मीन्स फॉर वन के जी वी हैव टू टेक टेन न्यूटन सो मीन्स जी वैल्यू इज टेन मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वेयर एफिशेंसी ऑफ पुली आफ्टर दैट वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट हाइट टू विच द लोड इज रेज इन फोर सेकेंड Now carefully see. First, we have to calculate power input to the pulley, taking force of gravity as like this. Power input, which is work input over time. Work input we have input means we are applying the force on the machine. So here we will take effort into displacement of effort over time. Now what is effort? Effort. If I am talking about a fixed pulley is driven by. Driven by means the force applied on the machine is given as hundred kg. So now let's calculate into newton. So hundred into as one kg is ten newton. So hundred kg we have hundred into ten that is thousand newton. So here we got it as effort as thousand newton. Displacement of effort as it is a fixed pulley. so displacement of load and displacement of effort is same which is 8 meter given and time is given as 4 seconds so now here just calculate here we got it as power as 2000 watt you can also write it as 2 kilowatt clear next we have to calculate the efficiency of the pulley efficiency we have mechanical advantage over velocity ratio so mechanical advantage we have load upon effort load is given as 75 kgf 75 kgf let's convert it into newton multiply with g and g is given as 10 effort we have already calculated on 100 that is 100 into g that is 1000 we have calculated recently so here we got it as 75 by 100 which is 3 by 4 or you can also write 0.75 so mechanical advantage we got it as 0.75 and velocity ratio for a single fixed pulley always we have to take it as 1 so here we got 0.75 which is also called 75% when you will multiply with 100 0.75 convert it into percentage so efficiency of the pulley we got it as 75% clear Next, we have to calculate the height to which load is raised. Load is raised means the displacement of load. We have to calculate. We know that velocity ratio is equals to displacement of effort over displacement of load. As it is a single fixed pulley, so velocity ratio is one. Displacement of effort we have eight meter. So here, displacement of effort is eight meter, and displacement of load we have to calculate from cross multiply. We got displacement of load as 8 meter so this is our answer clear